I've been an entrepreneur ever since I think I was born and then when I was kicking my mom to get out quickly to try and start a business. So. Hi, I'm Dave. Katya and I have teamed up with Neil from U.S. Captain's Training to bring you the Captain's Chat to vlog about interesting people in the marine industry. They share some of their life with us so we can share it with you. On this episode, we talk to Kevin, owner of Diamond Tropical Hardwoods, about sustainably growing tropical hardwoods on his tree farms and sawmills in Costa Rica and his reforestation efforts. What I'm most proud of after my children, my four kids, are tree planting, and that's what I enjoy the most. Like if I go out and get working on reforestation projects and tell me a, tell me the name of one tree in endangered extinction. Nobody can. Everybody knows about pandas, everybody knows about tigers or like sea turtles. Wood is like a human face or a fingerprint. There are no two pieces the same. I, so like, mangoes, a funny wood. I send out a lot of free samples. People call me and they said, oh, I didn't like that, but when I put a finish on it, pop, shazam, wow, it's like Kramer in uh, Simon's <laughs> hair shooting out of his head. <laughs> teak will grow 18 to 24 inches in a month. But teak, it's almost like a light switch goes off. At year 25, it turns into wood that's really good for marine use. It's not only what we do today, it's what we do that will affect seven generations in the future and it's like something these are really cool when you put a piece of glass on them so you can see what it looks like i mean mother nature is amazing i made a point of like empowering the women make them into form and stuff a lady come to me she's like kevin i don't like this i'm the only lady at these meetings i'm like that's the point we want to have three ladies at these meetings and we want to have <laughs> ten we want to have one of you running the place when there's different uh nationalities or religions or whatever it's hard to get a consensus, but I think we can all agree that we should be planting more trees.